noises. Sorry if I sound a little nervous. I'm still really shy. <laughs> Just kidding, guys. That is not me. So before we start the video, I would like to thank you all so, so much for 20k subs. It really means a lot to me. And I appreciate each and every one of you guys that were along with me or coming along with me in this journey. Just want to get that out there. I appreciate you and I love you all so, so much. So P underscore K says from our Discord server, how did you first find Roblox and especially Tower of Hell? So I found Roblox all the way back in 2016 and no, I don't remember any of my past accounts. However, I did ideally start playing Roblox seriously around 2020 and got into obbying Arsenal and a bit of Robeats and Rhythm games in general. Tower of Hell was a game I found randomly across my homepage which I ignored at the time. All was well until I saw content creators like Flamingo making videos on it due to how hard it really was. That really got me interested and since then I started playing Dark Hell. A major part of my inspiration came from Pink Leaf, but I quit within a few days. Again, around 4 months ago, I started playing, but this time taking it seriously as I saw most of the content creators I was fangirling upon quit and I just knew that I couldn't let the game die and took the responsibility in my hands. Lee says, when did you start playing Roblox and what do you think of the whole situation going on with Hey Rosalina? Again, I started Roblox around 2016. And about the Hey Rosalina situation, I just know I can't really do anything about it since it's a natural instinct to see someone pop up randomly after her disappearance with almost a similar name. However, so I feel like it's not that of a big deal since I can't really do anything about it. Plus, all the people that really commentate on it, no matter how many times I've made it clear that we're not. We're different people. They are pretty much helping me boost my algorithm, which is good for me, so I guess keep it up. l one Ain says, How I grew my child so fast. I would say a lot of research and lots of experiences on how the algorithm works and functions. Jolin says, Will you maybe make a new channel someday and make other contents like MM2? I most definitely will at some point of the time, just not really sure when. Robin underscore Cruza says, Are you Hey Rosalina's little sister? Again, even though it's obvious, no. And she doesn't even have a sister. We X Lux says, Can you do a hand cam video? Probably yes, since a lot of people have been speculating if the gameplay is really mine. So ideally, I have three goals, which are voice reveal at 20k, which I'm doing right now, face reveal at 100k, and hand cam video at 200k. Helen Bay says, why did you name yourself Real Rosa? To be frankly honest, I was just messing around and seeing available tags for my YouTube. I like roses, but there are already too many channels with roses, so I just named myself Real Rosa as a form of an acronym. Why were you inspired to make a YouTube channel? I was inspired to make a YouTube channel because all the content creators quit and I knew that I couldn't just let the fan base die. I was waiting for a miracle and someone to pop up eventually but no one did. So I had to go ahead and take it to my own hands. Leicasta says, can you give tips to small content creators like us? The biggest tip I could give would be consistent uploading and bang your thumbnails on every video. Make sure that along your journey, your quality just gets better and better. One of my moderator, Rati, asks what my age is, where I'm from, and will I make a game like Drop Hell? So, I'm 16, I'm from Indonesia, and I most likely will, and I already got some plans ready for it. Moon says, How I managed to be good in Drop Hell, my favorite color, and tutorial on Drop Hell, how to be good in it. Firstly, thank you for calling me good, even though I'm not. I would say lots of practice and consistency. Just trust the process. My favorite color is cherry red. And sure, I can do a tutorial for it, specifically for you. Tick says, what keyboard I use, what other games I enjoy playing other than Tower of Hell, and what different hobbies I would play from Tower of Hell. First, I use a custom built keyboard with EG Oreo switches. I would say mostly trading games and arsenal. And I will try different hobbies of course, but for now I will create a few more Tower of Hell related content. Mano says, if I'm a BTS ARMY or no BLACKPINK. I have heard of them, but I don't really listen to their music in general, but I think they're amazing artists and I support whatever they're doing. 
how long are you playing Tower of Hell for and where are you from? I'm from Indonesia and I'm playing Tower of Hell fully committedly for more almost 5 to 6 months now. Lastly, Scriptify says, what's my gender? It's a she. Alright, that's the end of the video everyone. I do would like to clarify some things such as my account, that extras, and my Discord account in general. Both of these accounts were owned by my classmates before I took it, so there are a lot of random messages across servers that is most probably not by me. If you do want to have my original profile, it's realrosayt. Make sure to go check that out. Also, I'm very sorry if I couldn't include you in this video as there were too many requests, but I can assure you that I have read every single one of them. Anyways, that's the end of the video. I hope you all enjoyed your stay. Stay safe, everyone. Thank you.